Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think we're ready to make a start. So can I welcome you to this meeting uh, of the historical group? It's rather nice to be uh, chairing this morning. Uh, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Professor John Nicholson, and I'm the uh, secretary of the historical group. And this is not just a historical group meeting, it's a historical meeting because for the first time we have a hybrid meeting. So I'm also welcoming people viewing remotely uh, who are, have also joined us. So I, I'm sure it's not the first hybrid RSC meeting, but it's the first one that we as the historical group have organised. So welcome both in person and remotely. Uh, for the in-person folk, I need to just remind you of the domestic arrangement. If the fire bell goes, uh, we need to go out of the way we came in and we need to assemble. I understand we assemble under the statue of Sir Joshua Reynolds, which I suppose could be rather attractive, uh, at least possibly not today, but on other occasions. But I'm not anticipating us having to do that. Can I also draw attention to the fact that we have uh, here uh, the Nobel Prize certificate awarded to George Porter and also some uh, photographs, a series of photographs of George Porter's research group at the RI from the late 1960s to the mid 1970s. So there's some interesting things to have a look at on the table just in the middle of the room there. Uh, lastly, in terms of uh, practical arrangements, I want to say that uh, we have made arrangements for our uh, remote participants to be able to ask questions uh, and they'll be uh, sending messages in via the chat facility on Zoom. And I, I'm hopeful that Frank, wherever Frank has gone, uh, will be able to relay the questions so we can actually um, have people participating, whether they're physically present or at a distance. So that's, if you like, the practicalities and getting ready. It's now an enormous pleasure to start proceedings. We have, uh, following each other in rapid succession, uh, with the same title of Living Above the Shop, our memories of the Royal Institution, firstly, Professor John Porter, and then Dr. Andrew Porter. So first of all, Professor John Porter. <laughs> 